All right, everybody. We are here in Juno Beach, Florida. I'm out here with Frisky Fins, Yakima Jack, the Lawless Tide. We are gonna hit multiple locations this week while we're here in South Florida. We're gonna try to knock some new species off the list. As always, so glad you're here. Thank you for watching. We're going ahead and check out what we get into. Today, we're at the Juno Beach Pier, and it's a completely different pier experience than what I'm used to here in Alabama. There are a lot of days in Alabama where we use line as light as six pound fluorocarbon, but there was absolutely nothing light about the tackle we were using here. This was just straight up combat fishing. Our bait was six to eight inch live croaker, and the line we were using was 80 to 100 pound mono. And even with that super, super heavy gear, fish were still pulling hooks and breaking leaders. There he is. There he is. Get him out, get him out. Get him, come on. Oh, he got me hung up. Which way is he? He's over here. Oh. That's heartbreaking. Ah. Hello, ducky. Close. Little croaker. <sighs> At least that's some excitement. The hook. Walk, 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 walk. I'm trying. Walk, 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 walk. walk this way, Jordan. Walk. Come this way. Come this way. I'm coming this way. There you go. <laughs> I'm coming this way. Got him up. Come on. Get him. Get him. Crank. Crank. Pump him. No, oh, don't let him out here. Oh, I hear him. Come on. Come on. Oh, man, that's big boy. He's up. Oh yeah. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh that's cool. Thumb it. Thumb it. Get up. Get ah. Jeez. Whew. That was a thing. That was Whew. a thing. Good. Whew. Whew. Last broke with you? Yeah, I'm wrapped around it. Dang. Cut me. Just cut it. Alright. Did he whoop you? You okay? No. No, mentally I'm not. Physically I'm all right. Mentally, no. Right here, me and Sean are freelining some croaker on spinning gear because we were watching some of these big snook come higher up into the water column when we were seeing if they would chase one of these. Oh. Oh. Yeah, oh. Shit. The barracuda. Got a barracuda. Barracuda. No, I didn't. What the hell? <laughs> Nothing. I didn't touch it. No, slice it in half. Oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> touch it. Sorry, I didn't see it. I saw the spins moving. Something something munched on it. Yeah. Yeah. Big, yeah, big old cooter jumps when it Damn. Out. <laughs> didn't get to a, little, a little afraid. Okay, I was off. About how to barracuda. He didn't touch it, he just. Cut it. Yeah, he just bit it in half. <laughs> well, that was exciting for a moment. Yeah, it was. Now, fishing for snook off this pier was not nonstop excitement. There was a lot of downtime in between bites, sometimes even a couple hours. Our view was mostly just staring down at the water, anticipating when it was going to be our chance to try to land one. Right here I dropped my GoPro under the pier because I wanted to see what was under there. And as you can see with the amount of bait around, it's amazing we even get hooked up on these snook at all. Right here you can see a lot of the LY swimming around, a couple mangrove snapper next to the pylons, and the striped fish are called sergeant majors. While I had my camera under the water, the current was pretty strong and it was very difficult to hold it still. But here you can start seeing some of those large snooks show up inside the frame. Here in just a second you're going to start watching these LY scatter as a big snook swims around the pylon. Thank you. 
It took me a lot of hours and a lot of broken off fish, but it was finally my time to land a snook. Yeah, I got him. Got him. Come on. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm holding him. I'm holding him. Get that net. Get that net. Uh, here, here. Sean, I'll, I got it. I'll, I'll net my own. Holy cow, I forgot to even talk when I got hooked up there. Oh man. Get him? Yeah. Oh, he's small. Don't call him small. <laughs> I thought he looked bigger down there. That is the that is the smallest snook I've ever caught though. And Just be because it's the biggest and the only. Whew, awesome. Did you start that camera? Yeah, I don't have it on, but I'm gonna bring it over. Whew. Alright. <sighs> Easy, dude. Yeah, I don't know why you're yelling at me. I was, I was netting this fish. <sighs> when you were uh, reeling it in, it swam perfectly in between the <laughs> islands. I know. I got lucky there. It's beautiful. <laughs> How long do you think that is? Oh, I have no idea. But it's the first snook I've ever caught, so I'm happy with it. What? Yeah, yeah. Got your picture? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna have it on camera oh, right here. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I'm in the No, no, you're fine. Me out. Yeah. There we go. Finally caught a snook. Took me two days. We've been out here literally since uh, seven o'clock this morning. Finally got hooked up on my first snook. So this is the smallest, it's the biggest, it's everything. But I'm super, super excited to finally get on a snook. But we're gonna get this guy back. Jack, take my picture. Thank you. All right, Jack's gonna put him back for me. Bye, dude. And he's out. All right, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, comment down below if you liked what you saw, but keep an eye out for the next video because that's gonna wrap up the pier video, but we're also gonna head up to Jupiter. We're gonna hit the Jupiter Inlet, see what we can catch around the jetties up there, but I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up. So until next time, I'll see you later.